Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing well and staying safe. For this video we'll be going through an unboxing of the Evangelion Mechanics uh, and this is the booster unit from the Evangelion 3.0 You Cannot Redo movie and this was released by Bandai back in 2013. So this will be the second half of the Ava Mechanics uh, little mini-series to commemorate my first year of uh, doing YouTube content. So I thought I would do a bit of a flashback to what started this all, which uh, was some Ava-based videos that um, got the ball rolling. So if you saw the previous um, video, you would have seen the unboxings for the, um, the AAA Wonder. Uh, from obviously 3.0 uh, for the unboxing for this set we'll be looking at the booster unit so at the beginning of the film units 2 and 8 are retrieving uh, unit 1 and obviously these booster units make themselves quite known during that opening sequence so there we have unit 2 uh, with its nice little machine gun um, attached to its booster unit and there is also Ava unit 8. So the booster will be in nice colour as for these little shields the Avas themselves will be in this um, single clear coloured uh, plastic. So that's the front of the box, bottom of the box nothing useful, uh, one side of the box just covering off the booster unit um, I believe this was the film's formal written label and then the top booster unit and there is a line art of the booster unit so that's the front and the sides in terms of the back so this part of the box is pretty much the same as the wonder so that was the wonder set this is the booster set um, so it'll be that or that, whereas the Wonder was a Wonder and one of the three Avas, and I was very fortunate I did get each and every single one. Um, as for this one, because there's three of them, there will probably be a duplicate. Unless there actually is a th third hidden booster one, which, I don't know, who knows, maybe it's unit one and it's little cross. Um, but anyway... Booster, in this case Unit 8 on it, um, on its stand. So if we crack open the box, um, so inside we will have, so this one will have Unit 2, pretty cool. We obviously have all the parts of what's in the box, the instructions are inside the box, and there is a piece of gum that was included. And as I mentioned in the previous video, I do not think I'll be consuming that gum. I also like how there's actually um, bubble. This actually is bubble wrap. Wow. I forgot about some of the packaging for some of these things. It was pretty cool back in the day. Okay, so bubble wrap. Fair enough. Um, oh gosh. There's bubble wrap and tape everywhere. Um, okay, now that I can unwind this, so unlike the Wonder, there won't be a lot of um, build to do, but um, that booster unit is very, very solid. Uh, so they've got the booster unit there, and it's covered in a bit more bubble wrap. Um, so there won't be too much building to do, that's pretty much all one solid piece. Um, there is the stand. And looking at the stand, it's actually quite uh, similar, if not the same as the one that's in the window. So you could almost have all the Avas together on one of these things. Um, as I mentioned before, this one has every unit too. It's a shame that they did it in this weird clear plastic because it is a bit difficult to actually make out the Ava. Um, but there it is. 
so that's one of them. Um, no, I actually haven't opened the other two thus far. So there's the other two. One of these will probably be an Ava 8. The other one um, remains to be seen. Um, so this one, I believe, is Ava 8. Yes. Just do that. Um, get rid of the um, additional wrap. That should be fun now that I've got some bubble wrap. I can do this. Anyway, I'll try it here, but that did feel good. Um, let me do that one. Let me this piece of tape. Okay. Um, well actually, it is worthwhile having a look at this one. So, I actually did forget that the shield components um, actually were different colours. So, it was red and black for Unit 2, and it's pink and black for Unit 8. And just having a feel of this, it does actually feel like there's some degree of um, um, movement somewhere around the shield bit. I know the shields can probably move up and down so um, because I have noticed that um, this plastic bit here has actually depegged itself so the boosters are over. Um, still the same base but being a unit 8 there's actually two additional parts so there is a additional accessory basically uh, have the end of Unit 8 sniper rifle uh, attached and then we have Unit 8 doing its little uh, bow out pose um, which it did do in the opening sequence uh, because it uh, was already starting to lose um, altitude and basically had to make a break for it so there is a clear unit eight. As for the last one, um, I think it'll be another unit too, to be honest. They actually get into the box. How annoying. It's actually well hidden. Um, but actually it does look like I was right and I do believe it is another unit 2 so two unit 2's let's still take one this one's actually a bit more tough to get rid of that's that Ooh. oh no sorry 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 I got excited there for a minute because I don't miss the colour actually made it look like it might have been um, the Mark 6 but no, that, that is that is definitely another unit too. Um, yeah, definitely another unit too. Oh, why does this one seem different? Hmm, that's probably just my imagination. Yes, it is another unit too. Just so happens that, um, as I said, it, um, the colouring was a little bit darker. So, um, yeah, I almost mistook it for the Mark VI. Um... So that's the unboxing side of things done. Let me see what I can do about uh, having a look at the instructions. So, 
here's the insides of the booster unit. Um, so obviously the booster units you are needing to clip that on to its little clear plastic stand as that I assume will subsequently attach to the base itself. There does seem to be a little extra piece here that will um, attach somewhere as well. The instructions for more specifically for unit 8 to attach the sniper rifle into the shield components. So the shields are detachable by the looks of things. And lastly, the other bit and the all important bit. So we have unit 8, unit 2, and I suspect this is supposed to be a special version of unit 2. And given that it's been somewhat discolored here, I am wondering if that is basically a special discolored version, well, different color version of unit 2. It's definitely suggesting something as a version here, but um, sadly I can't read Japanese and I also seem to be bumping the camera. Um, in terms of adding the Avers, pretty much flip the shield open, attach them to the back of it like they were in the movie, and um, there you go. So there you have it. And I have done a very clever sneak and it wasn't going to be just one or the other there was a special version. So with that being said, it doesn't help that they're not open. But, um, so on the right side will be what I suspect is your standard normal version of the unit 2. And then on the left is the color variant of unit 2. So there you go. It just makes me wonder, it's almost like a unit 2 colored as unit 1 of sorts. I mean it's kind of looks like a bit of a slight purple color. Who knows, maybe it's supposed to be an awakened unit 2. Anyway. Um, so there you go, there actually is two different unit 2's included. Um, so that'll definitely be fun once that's fully opened up and um, have a proper look at that when it's not in a sheet of plastic. So that pretty much brings us to the end of the unboxing of the booster unit. <coughs> um, definitely an interesting talent revelation there of having that um, extra special version of unit 2 included um, so I've been very fortunate and pretty much in terms of the Avers have each and every single one of them um, I just have multiple boosters and wonders and everything in between but that's no major problem at all it's definitely been a fun unboxing well unboxing thank you very much for watching this video feel free to leave a like a comment and subscribe if you haven't done so already um, all of this does help support the channel and I do appreciate the support. Extra content can also be found in my Instagram account, link in the description down below. Uh, but it is basically the same handle as this YouTube channel. Stay safe and take care everyone and I will catch you all in the next video. See ya.